All of the composers that we work with on the Composers Hub are already at a professional level of, of writing. The thing that they don't have the chance to do very often is to write for a full symphony orchestra. When is a young composer going to get a professional orchestra to try something out for them? Most young composers and emerging composers are lucky if they are even able to work with a couple of, of musicians at a time, let alone an orchestra. I think it's a vital process for all composers who wish to write for orchestra, which I'm sure we all do. This is a fantastic opportunity for a composer to learn how the dynamics between composer and orchestra and conductor and orchestra and conductor and composer work. When you write, it, 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 it doesn't feel like it's real yet because it's mere just instructions. When the orchestra plays it, that's when the music actually materializes and it's, it, it's, it's an incredible feeling. Just the chance to get into the room with someone like the RSNO is very, very difficult at the best of times. And so when you have a dedicated workshop like this, you're in a position where you can just show up, be you, do what you need to explore, find the next steps and build upon it that way. A lot of composers I know have done this scheme and they've spoken so highly of it and how it's benefited them um, in their professional career. So I knew I had to apply. Being able to work so closely with musicians and hearing you know, what they have to say about your music is just an invaluable opportunity for a composer. And having it with an orchestra is almost unheard of. It'll always be a bit nerve wracking as well to have the material that you've, you know, that you've been working with um, explored in that detail. It's also like having all of your Christmases all at once. Working with Stuart and then Roxana has been hugely beneficial to me as a composer. They've been able to unlock parts of my music which I've never been able to see before. The mentoring has been fantastic, loads of artistic ideas but also lots of um, helpful practical thoughts. It's a huge privilege to be a mentor. I see my role not just as a sort of technical composition mentor, but also to give them the confidence to be able to ask for what they want to do. Really, everybody needs something different. So I try to get to know what makes the composers tick, uh, trying to anticipate what they might need in terms of support and help. For me, it's a, really about trying to be a supportive colleague, I guess, you know, to make sure that they know that they've got somebody that they can bounce ideas off and get feedback from. I've been so grateful that RSNO has not abandoned this scheme or put it on pause for the unforeseeable future because we all need something to work towards and have motivation in our lives and it's, and it's really provided that. Often as composers we work in complete isolation so being able to work and meet with your peers is just so beneficial because you learn so much about your own music through their music and how they work with the orchestra. You almost learn just as much from, from hearing other composers work uh, played for the first time in workshop as, as you can from hearing your own. I'm always sat there going, oh, what was that effect? How did they write that? And then I go and look in the score and I think, oh, that's a really excellent way of writing that. I'm going to try and bank that for myself for the future. So yeah, it's absolutely wonderful. I feel I've gained confidence with how to interact with performers and the conductor as well. Just that little extra bit of prestige of working with such a major orchestra as well. The talent of the musicians across the board was really rather incredible. There is just this feeling that everyone wants it to go well, everyone really knuckles down and does a fantastic job of it. You know, as a composer, we write for musicians to play our music, so actually hearing it after months of silence has just been so uplifting and it's something I'm never going to take for granted again.